matcha versus coffee, well, it is always hard to choose one between these two. Although coffee drinks are made from coffee beans, while matcha tea is made from green tea powder, these two beverages also have some similarities besides their differences. What does matcha and coffee have in common? 1. Both of these beverages have high content of caffeine which make them a perfect drink to start a day. 2. Both are packed with many valuable antioxidants which help in reducing possibility of heart disease as well as assisting in fighting against many types of cancers. 3. These two drinks also help you to lose weight if they are used correctly. We have learned the similarities of matcha and coffee, now let jump to the differences between these two. Matcha versus coffee caffeine content. Starting with the most important factor because both coffee and matcha are caffeinated drinks. You need to be very careful about your caffeine intake. Taking a considerate amount of it can benefit you largely. However, taking a higher caffeine intake can be harmful to you. In coffee, there are 95 mg of caffeine in per 240 ml cup of coffee. Different types of coffee beans used in the brewing methods will change this number slightly. On the other hand, in the same size cup of matcha green tea, there are around 70 mg of caffeine. Depend on the concentration of the matcha powder used, the caffeine content might be a little higher or lesser. In general, coffee has more caffeine than matcha per serving. How long does matcha caffeine last compared to coffee? As we learned above that matcha green tea has much lower caffeine content compared to coffee. However, interestingly that the caffeine in these two drinks is absorbed in the human body differently. It only take 10 minutes for the caffeine to kick in and 35 minutes to reach its peach after drink coffee. Once it is in the body, it will last up to 3 hours, then the effect of caffeine will drop significantly. So what is about matcha green teas? It seems to be quite opposite. It take 3 to 4 hours for the caffeine to have full effect after drinking matcha and it can last up to 5 or even 6 hours in your body. The reason behind this slow absorbance is because matcha tea is made from Camellia sinensis plant like regular green tea. Thus it does not only have caffeine but also the L-theanine which help your body absorb caffeine slowly. Understanding this important difference will help us to determine when is the best time to drink matcha tea or coffee. If you need a quick awaken effect, you should go for coffee. On the other hand, if you just want a caffeinated drink to help you stay more focused for the day without caffeine jitter effect, then you, you choose matcha tea. Health Benefits of Matcha versus Coffee Now, let us quickly cover the health benefits of these two beverages. Before we begin, please know that you can enjoy these health benefits only if you take moderate and safe amounts of these two drinks. First, let us see how coffee is beneficial for your health. 1. Considerate coffee consumption lowers the risk of type 2 diabetes. 1. Coffee preserves the function of beta cells in your pancreas, which are primarily responsible for insulin regulation. 2. Drinking a cup of coffee will significantly boost energy levels because it stimulates the central nervous system enough to fight fatigue. 3. Supports brain health and encourages optimal functioning. 3. It prevents Alzheimer's disease as well. 4. It can help to fight off depression. 5. Prevents liver scarring and boosts its optimal functioning. 6. People who regularly drink coffee have a 15% lower risk of a heart attack as it help reducing blood pressure which is very important for heart health. 7. Coffee typically helps to manage a healthy weight. 8. Coffee consumption can largely boost your vitality and longevity. Now, let us get to the health benefits of matcha tea. 1. Ideal for keeping the liver healthy and helps flush out all the toxins in your body. 2. Green tea in general is loaded with antioxidant properties such as catechins that help our body deal with free radicals. 3. It has the potential to prevent cancer. 4. Matcha can improve your brain function. 4. It can improve your attention and memory as well. 5. It helps lower blood pressure which reduce the risk of heart diseases. 6. Quite effective in weight loss. We see many shared benefits between matcha and coffee. Looks like both of these drinks are simply great for human health and well-being optimization. Next, we will shed light on the side effects of matcha and coffee. Side effects of matcha versus coffee. It is always great to be aware of both sides of the coin. That is why, we will now cover the side effects of matcha and coffee. Side effects of drinking coffee. 1. Coffee can create dependence because it is a kind of drug which stimulates the central nervous system. 1. Drinking too much coffee can even cause caffeine addiction as well. 2. It can drastically increase your heart rate. 3. It can cause insomnia. 4. In some cases, it can even cause anxiety too. 5. 
Too much intake can lead to restlessness and upset your stomach too. 5. If you are sensitive to caffeine, you should consider decaf coffee. Side effects of drinking too much matcha green tea. 1. There is a high risk of contamination of lead and arsenic on the tea leaves. 1. Because it is made from pulverized green tea leaves. 2. Drink matcha tea is like eating the whole tea leaf, thus it can cause insomnia and diarrhea if you have sensitive stomach. 3. Overconsumption can cause liver toxicity. 4. It can be highly harmful to pregnant women as high caffeine intake increases the risk of miscarriage. 4. Instead you should check out decaffeinated tea. Which do you pick? Coffee or matcha? It is hard to answer this question as it all depends on your personal preferences and your purposes. Since coffee will provide quick and instant energy boost, you might need it for urgent situation. However, if you need a long-lasting caffeine effect, you should choose matcha. If you are more of adventurous drinker, you can add matcha to your morning coffee. The green color will transfer beautifully while also providing an extra boost of concentration and energy to tackle the day ahead. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to the channel for more interesting videos.